Greetings, my young pupil. Your progress has been most remarkable so far. Are you here to continue your training in the ways of the Jedi? Soon your apprentice in the training. These fur you might there is. There is no ignorance. There is no passion. There is no chaos. There is no death. You have learned your studies well, apprentice. It will not be long before you are a full member of our order. But first, you must pass the second test and learn about the most prized possession of a Jedi. The very symbol of our order, the lightsaber. The lightsaber is the traditional weapon of our order. It is a symbol of a Jedi's skill, dedication, and authority. And each lightsaber is as individual as the Jedi who wields it. The blade is made of pure energy, focused by polished crystals in the hilt. As the second test, each Jedi must construct his lightsaber with his own hands. And now it is your time. Speak with Master Dorak, and he will guide you through the choosing of a crystal. Ah, you have come, young apprentice, at Master Zar's bidding. He sees great promise in you. As do I. The time has come for you to choose the color of your lightsaber. This color also reflects your demeanor and position within the Order. Blue is the color of the Jedi Guardian. This Jedi battles against the forces of evil and the dark side. They focus more on combat training and use of the lightsaber. Yellow is the color of the Jedi Sentinel. This Jedi ferrets out deceit and injustice, bringing it to light. They focus less on combat, and more on other skills and abilities. Green is the color of the Jedi Consular. This Jedi seeks to bring balance to the universe. They mediate between other groups, using their powers to end conflict and preserve peace. Indeed, we shall see. I will now ask you questions, and your responses will indicate which class you lean most towards. A woman and her small child are beset by a desperate-looking group of thugs. They're menacing her with weapons, and she screams to you for help. What do you do? Hmm. Indeed. Very well. On to the next question. You are in combat with a dark Jedi allied with the Sith. There is a pause in the combat. What do you do? Yes, I suspected as much. Now for the next question. There is a locked door, and your goal lies on the other side. What do you do? I am beginning to see a pattern here, apprentice. I have a feeling about what you would be best at. But first, the final question. You are the head of an enclave on a contested world. The Dark Jedi have infiltrated and are causing unrest across the planet. What do you do? Yes, I thought as much. As I suspected, 
You would be most suitable as a Jedi Consular. Which color and path do you believe yourself most suited to, Apprentice? Here is a blue crystal for your lightsaber. Go speak to Master Jar again and he will instruct you in how to construct it. Done extremely well in constructing your lightsaber. Your crystal seems to have been set perfectly. It is rare indeed for that to happen the first time one constructs their lightsaber. These crystals are very rare, found only in certain caves strong in the Force. By adding crystals to your lightsaber, you can alter or enhance its properties. There have even been unconfirmed rumors of certain Force-sensitive caves here on Dantooine that may hold these. It is a rumor only. I do not know if there's any tr But you must learn first to use your lightsaber and take care when drawing it. Your lightsaber identifies you as a member of the Jedi Order. With such recognition comes honor and respect. And the attentions of dangerous enemies. The Sith and Dark Jedi will seek to destroy you, Apprentice. And you must prove yourself worthy in battle against a foe who also wields a lightsaber. Are you ready to face the final challenge, Apprentice? For every Jedi, the threat of the dark side is always present. You must truly understand this before you are accepted into the Order. You must see the corruption of the dark side for yourself. Even here on Dantooine, there are places where the dark side holds sway. Twisting and t the ancient grove once used for deep meditation by the Jedi is now tainted. A wave of darkness, the Cath Hounds in the area have become savage and ruthless. They have become a threat to the settlers. A threat the Jedi have. The Cath Hounds are but a symptom of the true problem. You must journey into the grove and confront the true source of the darkness. That is your task. I can say no more. Some things you must see for yourself. But remember this, my young apprentice. A Jedi act the dark side still paints the ancient grove. Your lessons cannot continue until the You should ponder the history of Revan. It contains. May the. Good evening, apprentice. Very... I see you insist on wandering the hall. 
If you have questions, you should direct them to... by too many settlers. Greetings, apprentice. Though I understand you shall not have that lowly title much longer. Soon he feels you will attain the rank of Padawan. Then you will truly... With power comes responsibility. And only by learning discipline and... I wish you luck in your training, apprentice. There is much you must yet... Rahasia Sandral is a nice young woman, but her father has been keeping her at their estate. Did you hear about the young Jedi girl from a couple days ago? Hey there. I'm sorry for the way I acted before. It's just that when it comes... My brother and me had a good thing going. Sure, Griff had his run-ins with the law on terrace, but we got by okay, until Lena came and She was a dancer at the cantina where my brother used to go play Pazic. Griff could be a real smooth talker, but Lena was used to dating rich Theresian nobles, guys with mountains of credits. Griff could never give her the lifestyle she was... I'm not going to pretend Griff wasn't a hustler and a con artist, but that doesn't mean you can just insult it. I thought Lena would brush Griff off when she saw how poor he was, but for some reason, she stuck around. After they'd been together for a few months, Griff told me he was leaving Terrace. He and Lena were going to try and make their fortune off-world. He promised as soon as he made enough credits, he'd come back and get me, and we'd all live like royalty. That was two years ago. I haven't seen him since. I don't even know where he went. Oh, I know what happened. As soon as she got him off Taurus, Lena sunk her claws into Griff but good. She twisted him around her little finger and made him forget all about me. I know I'll probably never see Griff again. And part of the reason I came with you was the hope that I could find out what happened to my... Don't worry. I won't let the search for Griff get in the way of what we're doing. Let's just get back... I'm not the one you should ask about Dantooine. I didn't even know there was a Jedi Academy here. I always thought it was just a bunch of set... Sorry I can't be more help, you know? Is there anything else I can do for you? Okay.
en defensa, pero no tiene casi ataque esta tipo. Oh, 
no voy a entrar aquí. Voy a revisar bien el mapa y por qué. Es algo interesante, volvemos. 